Hey, 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 YouTubers! Welcome back to Galactic Gaming. This is Highfield15 reporting for duty, and today we are back with what may or may not be the last episode of Mario Tennis Aces. Last time we played this game, we cleared off Inferno Island, but then Dark Waluigi and Dark Wario, or whatever their actual names are when they were possessed by Lucy and got the Reality Stone before us, and now we just had to do uh, duels of Peach and Daisy versus them and them. So I had to start this all over again because apparently there's no like checkpoint for this because I guess uh, I have to, it's like all one level, so I can't do so duels one time and then save solos for later. So I have to do this all over again, but nevertheless, guys, this is it. This is probably the final stretch to defeat Lucian. So just before we begin, you guys, give this video, please hit 15 likes. And if you're watching this and you're not subscribed, please be sure to smash the subscribe button. If you want a shout-out, be sure to show your subscription to me publicly if you want to make sure you got a shout-out. And where I accidentally initiated before I was kind of ready to go, but now it's time for the singles portion of the Lucian Cup. First up, we have Luigi. This bro has attained great power while under the control of Lucian. That is so Luigi. He's something something about that. And of course, the man who needs no introduction. They say he needs no introduction, and yet we have this cutscene going on here. It, yep, exactly. Says he. They say he's the man with no who needs no introduction. This happens. Mario, the legendary hero of the Mushroom Kingdom, the champion of the people, and something something. Yep, that is 100% Mario. They say he doesn't need an introduction, and yet here we are. This will be the last match of the day. So let's be honest. Mario is sure to win, like always. Okay, now that we're kind of into the game here, I got... Okay, don't be so sure, Lucian, um... Okay, yeah, otherworldly power, blah, blah, blah. So anyways, I saw the Nintendo Direct on Thursday, the last Nintendo Direct about Smash Ultimate before the actual game comes out, and I gotta say, it's... It looks really... It, like, it legit, it legit looks actually really good. So, like, the new newcomers are Ken as an Echo Fighter of Ryu and, uh, that Incineroar Pokemon, which I had actually never heard of up until the Direct, but... I gotta say, it looks really cool, and then of course the big shocker, apparently they're making a Piranha Plants an actual fighter, I didn't, I don't think anybody could have predicted that coming here, okay, I don't know why I'm doing all this stuff, well, maybe I'm just perhaps saving, like, well, yeah, I think I actually know what I'm doing here, I'm just, um, I've just gotten so good about after doing all that duo stuff with Daisy and Peach, so yeah, now I've just learned how to kind of ration my energy, and now it's Super Smash time. Let's see how Lucian gets a... Let's see how Lucian likes this. Oh. Oh, I actually dealt damage to Lucian. All right, I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to actually win the game by destroying Lucian, but you know what? I guess we're all about to find out here. Now, I don't want to run the risk of doing regular zone shots. Uh, ah, crap. Okay, I'll give him... I'll give him that, but again, the spirit mode and the story mode of Smash Ultimate, I really got to say, that absolutely blew my mind away. Uh-oh. Uh, that's not gonna be good. Unless you're me, and I've gotten good with my zone shot blocks, or zone speeds. But, again, I'm, I'm just... That's like the last direct uh, entire roster has been revealed, and they've confirmed that uh, that five DLC characters that, are, that they are apparently making from scratch are in the making. So, that is without a doubt gonna be awesome to play some original Nintendo, like, like brand new OC from Nintendo. So, yeah, I'm just overall absolutely impressed. Yeah, Mario takes this game. Okay, and and now it's uh, Dark Luigi or whatever you want to call it. So, yeah, uh, I've, I've never been so good with that part because I'm afraid that he'll, like, it'll be, it'll, I, it just brings back memories of the boom boom boss fight. Whoa, yep, that's what happens, Luigi, or should I say Lucien, who has reality and the space stones. I mean, I mean, I'm doing pretty good in spite of what stones he has. I think the reason I'm actually good at this is because I have the power stone, which is giving me all those uh, super powerful shots the time stone so I can just uh, I can just slow time down a little bit okay I couldn't slow time down long enough and then the soul stone so I could probably save Luigi from Lucian's grasp when this is all over with ah I didn't have enough energy and that wasn't really a good shot so yeah Luigi has that but let's not forget what I, what I at least expected he could potentially turn this uh, he could turn like the next super powerful shot into bubbles and yeah he could just portal around the place so <laughs> yeah I, I've taken a break from the, from the Infinity War jokes for a bit, but yeah, I'm still not letting up on those old Infinity War jokes. I am never, I'm probably never giving up the Infinity War jokes right there because, you know, that's just kind of been the running start. And plus, let's not forget, this game came out not too long after Infinity War 
uh, came out like about a month after Infinity War came out. So yeah, you're you know that's when you know I'm just bound to make some Infinity War jokes, even though they've kind of gotten old by now. All right, yeah, I mean we can damage Lucian all we want, but I don't. I think it's gonna be just like the duels match where it's just going until we hit until we actually win the game itself, instead of smashing people's rackets to pieces like I normally would. But you know what? Again, I am actually legitimately good at this. I thought I was gonna be absolute garbage like I normally am. But you know what? This is a this is an absolute shock. But I guess you know since this is probably the finale of the game, um, this since this is the finale of the uh, probably the finale of the game. I don't know. It may may not be the finale of the game. I don't know for sure. I guess we won't know until the end of the game. But. Yeah, I guess I've gone full pro, and, and again, maybe it was just because of the whole duos match that I got for practice before actually making this video. And again, mainly, probably, most likely because of the fact that I put up with this game's BS enough throughout, since uh, June, so like the past five months. Yeah, that's been five months that I've been playing this game, so yeah. Um, okay, now of course, as we all know, Super Smash Bros. Ultimate is available for pre-purchase on the Nintendo eShop, and of course, I am going to pre-purchase it in the coming days. Uh, actually, probably while I'm uploading this video, I'm probably gonna pre-purchase it. That's most likely the case for it. I'm just gonna head on downtown, get an eShop card, and then pre-purchase the most hyped game of the millennium. Like, I'm not even joking when I say that. For the past nine months, there has just been an unprecedented amount of hype for this game. Like, hype like you wouldn't actually believe. Like, I'm actually surprised how much hype this game has gotten. But actually, you know what? Now that I think about it, it's not that I'm actually thinking about what I, I'm saying. Saying, um, that is actually oh what he actually blocked that I didn't know you could block super shots until now well well you know it's uh it's Lucian and let's not forget he has a space well now space stone probably wouldn't do anything in terms of blocking that shot right there well you never know you never know I mean if we had one more power stone which would be yellow then that would all make sense here I mean I think Lucian kind of like the force of Lucian kind of doubles as uh, the mind stone here because it's like mind controlling people and then of course I guess the racket like the rest of the racket is just kind of the infinity gauntlet yes again not giving up those infinity war jokes yeah blazing wall jump all right get a load of this what okay he blocked that again and he got that point okay so I'm not sure how we were able to hit that one but you know what it's okay we're still absolute badass we're still absolute badasses at this match ah okay crap dark Luigi's caught up to us Again, not sure what to call it. Or Dark, Dark Luigi, Lucian. I mean, Lucian's controlling Luigi. So again, it's just all these questions one must ask him. One must ask himself to be or not to be. That is the question one must ask him. One must ask himself. So yeah, good old Shakespearean quotes here. Uh oh, ah, you pulled a sneaky on me, but you thought. Now, of course, since uh, this might be a big thing going on in Fortnite, but I guess there's supposed to be a live uh, event tomorrow in the game. And of course, when we say live events. Uh, the first thing that comes to mind when people say live events in Fortnite was the old rocket launch. Because I remember watching that event uh, back when I was still a bit of a default. And I was absolutely, like, I was just absolutely speechless by the end of that. And of course, I believe I've mentioned this many, many times. But I guess tomorrow's event is going to be involving the cube. So the cube will likely be, uh, probably be destabilizing and probably destroying. Because for the past however long it's been, uh, it's been cracking and just... Yeah, it's definitely been cracking progressively throughout, because Four Nightmares, I guess, is coming to an end tomorrow, and I haven't completed, like, all the things. I mean, I've gotten the contrails on the Dark Engine Glider, but I haven't gotten, like, the, like, the little, uh, fiery emote and the, um and the dead fire spray but you know what i completed a fair amount of them okay yeah this match is going on for a little longer than anticipated but you know what it's okay we are still pros at this today like we are absolute legends keeping it going all right now okay i don't think i'm gonna hit this one oh okay we actually damaged uh lucian okay i think i don't know but i think uh, i thought lucian originally had two health bars but now it just seems to be down to one, unless there's something I'm not paying attention to here. Yeah, there's likely something I'm not paying attention to. Yep, zone speed, extraordinary block, no damage. Yep, that's just what happens when you put up with this game and uh, with this game's BS enough. All right. Yep, blazing wall jump. I can expect this to get blocked if I'm not careful. So, uh, why? I knew I was gonna hit the net, but just why did I still proceed with that in any case? But. Pfft. 
Uh, you know what? Uh, Lucian's probably just laughing at me. I'm sure Luigi's not laughing because we all know Luigi. He's he's so innocent. He won't hurt a fly, and that explains why he died in uh, in the Smash Ultimate Direct back in August. That uh, with the, with Simon and Richter's reveal trailers. Oh, you thought? All right, now I gotta not screw this up. I've gotta not screw this up. And here comes that zone shot. So Wolusky. Ah, woo, returned against all odds. Check out that slide. Woo! Yeah, finally. Okay, that was quite a few deuces and advances, but, ah, my God. I'm actually, I almost feel bad for Luigi right here because we are just, by this point in time, we are just absolutely annihilating this dude. Whoa, returned at the very last minute. A textbook slide. All right, all right. Hmm. Yeah, these Toad commentators are... I'm not going to lie, I really do enjoy the Toad's commentaries, but I wish I had enough time and enough patience to actually read those. It's Luigi's serve. I mean, it's always going to be Luigi's serve as long as it's just solos right here. Oh, okay. Now, we're going to zone speed. Booski. Nope. I'm surprised that my flame rocket still hasn't broken yet, but of course I probably shouldn't get cocky with that because you never know what kind of sneaky I can pull. Woo! Ah... Uh, I don't know why I was going with an A shot. I should have clearly gone with the Y shot, but you know what? I hesitated for that split moment, and yet that's what happened. But seriously, just look at these blocks still. That was absolutely... Woo! Ah! Yeah, pulled off a nice vault. I think that's actually one of the first... Like, one of the few times I've actually pulled off a successful uh, trick shot like that. Uh-oh. Oh, oh I, clear I clearly gave him that one. But you know what? I didn't give him that one in the end because I, block I blocked that. Wait a minute, what was that one scream from the red toe? Just... Ah! Uh, I don't know either. Oh, I just waved to Luigi or Lucien. I don't know. You know what? I'm just going to call it Thanos. I'm going to call him Thanos Luigi. I'm just... I'm sorry. I'm not hesitating. with. I'm not pull, holding back. It's just no holds barred with the Infinity War jokes anymore. All right. We're going to defeat the Thanos rocket and uh, Thanos Luigi uh, in the end. And it looks like we're just one shot away from defeating Thanos Luigi. Ah... Uh, that Infinity Racket's going down. I would have preferred to smash it to pieces uh, like I normally would in most matches, but you know what? It's okay because I'm an absolute legend all of a sudden. And with that in mind, we've won! Excellent play! Woohoo! All right. Wow, that was definitely quite the match. Mario wins! All right, all right, all right, all right. Yahoo! Yeah, that's the spirit we want to see, and that's the first time I've ever watched a full replay here. All right, wow, just look at that. Okay, Luis, uh, Thanos Luigi got all the nice serves, and still just wow. I'm surprised how well that worked out. And there you have it. Mario is the winner. That's right, Toad. That is indeed right. Listening, listening to that defeating roar from the crowd, we're all thrilled to pieces about Team Mario's victory. It was an amazing match that kept us on the edge of our seats. Truly incredible. Luciana has lost its power and Luigi is saved. Now it's time to present the five power stones to Mario or the remaining two infinity stones that we don't have. Whoa. Okay, wait, what's this? Oh, Bowser, what the hell are you doing? It's Bowser. Bowser is taking a hold of Lucian. What in the world could this mean? Um, something definitely is nothing good because... Bowser now has Infinity Racket, and he's probably going to become Bowser, um, Thanos Bowser, I should say. Well, okay, that's just a nice, uh, last-minute plot twist. Uh, Bowser taking control of Lucian. Stop this, Bowser. That racket is dangerous. Yeah, of course, Bowser, he's sentient enough to talk, but yet he doesn't know the dangers of Lucian. Please, listen to me. You're under Lucian's spell. You must release that racket right now. Um, listen to you? <laughs> uh, oh my god, that is hilarious, Peach. Let's not forget all the times this guy has kidnapped you, and you're, you're telling him to listen to you? My god, you're losing it. Bwah! This racket has the power to rule over anyone. It's the perfect, it's perfect for a king like me. And yet, that's how King Bask ends up the way he did. This power is incredible. It makes me want to control everything even more than usual. It's exhilarating. Mario, meet me at the spot where this all started. We'll determine who is the strongest once and for all. With this power, I can't lose. Not even to you. Well, don't get so confident about that, B uh, Thanos Bowser. I can't believe this. Bowser really ran off with Lucian. Well, of course he did. It's Bowser. He ran off with it in the same fashion he ran out where he runs off with Peach pretty much every game. And it makes and to make matters worse, the power stones are gone too. Oh no. 
Oh, that I did not even think of that. Well, that's especially bad because now all Bowser has to do to control everybody on the island is probably snap his fingers. Bowser stole Lucian and the five power stones, containing the fragments of its power. This really puts a damper on our victory. Mario. Mario. Aster, it's you. Of course it is. There isn't a moment to spare. You must find Bowser right away. Bowser is in the deepest part of the ruins. He intends to return the Power Stones to Lucian and take it, its power for his own, and probably snap his fingers and mind control everybody on this island. That Bowser makes me so mad, and yet you have it in, in Peach's position one time, Daisies, but eh, you know what, Daisy's one of the more sassy kind of characters. Mario, this world faces total devastation unless we stop him. The only person who stands a chance is you. Please, Mario. Alright, looks like it's up to us because clearly nobody has the balls to do it. Oh. Oh, okay, we're literally going back to Basque Ruins to fight Thanos Bowser. We are literally doing that. Okay. Well, I really was not... I knew that this episode was going to be the last episode of this series, but I did not expect it to be like this, you guys. But, you know what? Alright, Thanos Bowser, it's go time. Oh, okay, look, my, look how you've changed in a matter of, like, 120 seconds. Bwah! Glad you can make it, Mario. Lucian and I are now one, allowing me to finally achieve absolute power. Sure, you clearly have leveled up a bit going on this your silly adventure, but you're no match for the almighty Balzian. Okay, yeah, you two have become one, and you're now calling yourselves Balzian? Okay, yeah, that's beginning to remind me of we are Venom. So in this case, it's now we are Bowsian. Or should we say Thanos Bowser in the end? You really don't intend to fight me, do you? Bwah! Fine, I'll happily be your opponent. Show me what you've got. Yeah, you really do not know what you're getting yourself into, Bowsian, or should I say Thanos Bowser? The final battle. Defeat that foul, foul Bowser who is in possession of Lucian. Or should we say Bowser Lucian? Or, ah, whatever. I don't know. I don't know. Oh. All right. Oh, God. Look at the Infinity Rocket. God, with all five Infinities. Okay. It's clear he's pulling the old Power Stone on us. So this is definitely not good. Bowsian. Oh, boy. This is it. Okay. What? We're losing... Uh... Oh, wait a minute. Uh... Oh, I was not... I wasn't ready for that one bit. All right. Uh... Booski. Ah. Uh, woo! Now, I just... All right. There we go. I've learned how to block... Shots without using zone speed uh, from the previous boss fight in the previous episode. Ah, uh, Booski! Yeah, how's that feel, Thanos Bowser? You really are no match for Mario. And I'm just surprised at how well I'm actually kicking this guy's booty. Um, okay, so it's just the balls that, uh, oh, I'm supposed to, oh, it's just like the, it's just like the Madame Mirror, Ma it's, it's just like the Madame Mirror boss fight. You just gotta shoot stuff. Oh, boy. Ah! Yep, we are clearly fighting with the Infinity Stones right here. God, now I know how Thor... Now I clearly know how Thor feels when he fought Thanos with uh, Stormbreaker. Alright, yeah, how's that feel, uh, Balzian? Again, it's just really reminding me of the whole Venom thing. Like, I haven't, I, have, I haven't seen the Venom movie yet, but I can tell it was probably pretty good. Just, we are Balzian. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, I can't... Yeah, I clearly can't do that, and you're clearly... Oh, God. Okay, yep, you are definitely pulling the Power Stone on us above any of the other uh, Infinity Stones right here. Let's just be thankful he's not turning any of our return shots to uh, bubbles like he did with uh, Star-Lord's shots. <laughs> yeah, again, it's the ultimate time for the Infinity War jokes right here. So, yeah, let's just... We just gotta stop him from snapping his fingers. That's just the, that's just the most crucial thing in the world. We just gotta stop uh, Thanos Bowser from snapping those fingers. Yeah. Oh. Woo! Okay. Well, again, I've hesitated to use these X shots for so long, and yet here I am now. Okay. Yeah, that clearly missed, but we're, do we're still doing we're still doing damage to Thanos Bowser. Whoa. Yeah. Woo! All right. Yeah. The the orbs keep uh, floating around like they keep swapping positions on us. Ah. Crap, okay, well, there goes one of my rackets, but you know what? I think I can still do it. Okay, I thought it was gonna... Ah, there we go. Okay, finally. I don't know why... Oh, what? Oh, God. If I have to rematch Thanos Bowser, I'm not gonna be too particularly happy about that. All right, finally. It's in a bit of, in a, bit of a better position to me, for me to actually hit it. 
Oh god. Okay. Here comes an infinity zone. Ah, uh, you know what? I think it's best if we just restart our boss fight cuz I am I am going to run out of time for sure. Okay, sorry, that was really embarrassing to just restart the Thanos Bowser, but you know what? It's fine, it's fine. We've done this many, we've restarted the boss fight, or a level in general, many times throughout this gosh darn series. So you know what? It really doesn't matter that much in the end. We just gotta, once more, focus on hitting those orbs. We just gotta hit them orbs and knock out them Infinity Stones if we can. I really, again, I really do like those sound effects. They're, they're just sound, they just sound so sci-fi-esque. Woo! Like, seriously, how could, how could one not like those sound effects? Like, for, just be real with me. How could one not like those sound effects? Alright. Thanos! I'm coming for you, boy. Like, just imagine if Thor entered the, a tennis tournament with Stormbreaker. Let's just say, uh, let's just say, Thanos, let's just say the blood would be spilling. Wait a minute. Um... Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh, wait a minute. These are all zone shots? Oh, okay. You are really going out all out with this, Belgian. You are really going all out with this. But, you know what? It doesn't matter. Okay, we just gotta remember that I guess those are all zone shots. And thankfully, they're traveling slow enough for me to uh, anticipate them. Okay, I can I can dodge those first ones, but just not the other ones. Ah. Alright, come on. Dodge. Okay, you know what? I still have enough energy. Ah! Oh, come on! Alright, you know what? We're just gonna... Oh, come on! I just jumped right into that. Uh, you know what? It's always just such a blitz to actually hit those, like, actually, uh, hit those vaults, but, you know what? It's okay. Alright, I'm at max energy, so haul at ya, boy! Okay, I was at max energy, but then I did the whole zone speedy. Okay, yep, you are really not stopping with this whole power stone thing. Okay. Alright. It's okay. Alright, uh, we just barely missed that one. And we missed that one. Alright, okay. Like, seriously, I mean, I'm just surprised at how far this game is coming, actually, in actual terms of its story. Um, but, of course, again, I've got some questions to Nintendo of how similar, the, like, how similar this kind of is to Infinity War. Okay, now I've just got to remember, i uh, got to hit them at just the right time, otherwise they're going to break. All right. Thanos! You'll die for this. Ah, uh, well, you'll die for it in a short matter of time. All right, you know what? Okay, I would have saved this for our last time, but you know what? Let's just save Thor's one-liner for our last. Uh, right, I have to wait. Uh, I just gotta wait till he's blocking. I forgot that I can't hit him while he's blocking like that. Okay, final 100 seconds. This is it, guys. This is the battle of the fates right here. Oh, wait. Oh, crap, I forgot. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Woo! Ah, crap. Okay, I, if I have to restart this again, this will be mildly embarrassing. Woo! Ah, crap. Okay, yeah, this is definitely not going anywhere good real fast. Woo! Alright, just rack up that energy. Okay, this is going to be a close one, you guys. I mean, we're probably going to have to do yet one more round against Thanos Bowser, but you know what? It's okay. I've done this enough. Woo! Uh, get him. Alright. Booski. Oh god, if we can actually... No, I doubt it. I doubt we're going to be able to actually beat Thanos Bowser on the second go. Woo! Uh, okay. Come on. Alright, yeah, we're not going to make it, so you know what? Okay, it's time for one last retry against... You know, actually, no, it's not going to be one last retry. We're just going to keep... We're just going to keep going at this until we actually beat Thanos Bowser. This is it, you guys. This is our... This is pretty much Mario's version of uh, the fight against Thanos on Titan. Well, except, you know, except at that time, Thanos didn't really have all the Infinity Stones. He just had... Uh, Power, soul, mind, reality. Yeah, no, actually, no. He had power, soul, space, and reality. Not mind. Mind was the last one he got before he did, did the old snappy, snappy up the fingers. Okay. Ah, uh, Bisky. Yeah, boy. Woo! Okay, this is it. Woo! All right, come on. There we go. I mean, I really got to try and focus on hitting more of those shots, and I just really need to focus on actually hitting those successful dodges here. Yeah, your Power Stone, now that I've actually kind of caught on to your uh, method of the Power Stone, I've gone, I've gotten your thing down. Okay, and I assume each heart represents uh, Lucian's life, because we're hitting Lucian straight, like, we're hitting 
uh, Lucian like head on with that stuff. Woo! All right, we can easily dodge that stuff by just simply running around. I think we can dodge all this stuff by just merely running around. Woo! Ah, boy, you thought. Up, up, Booski, and one Booski. All right, I'm gonna wait till the first zone shot opportunity comes up with this and see uh, how much damage I can actually do. And it's uh, uh, blazing wall shot time, or whatever the toe was calling it. Holla at ya, boy, uh, Thanos Bowser. Okay, of course he blocked it. I didn't think that was gonna have any other positive effect, but you know what? It was still worth the experimentation. Woo! Ah, you seriously really need to step up your game, uh, Thanos Bowser. Okay. Woo! Yeah, right back at ya. Just like uh, that anime Kirby used to have, or whatever the case was. I mean, uh, you can give animated series to uh, Mario and Link, and apparently it didn't really work out too well. But yet you give an uh, anime to Kirby, and I guess it was like a huge success. But yeah, that's why I, re I reason to believe like, the one anime we truly need is, uh, is a Metroid anime, just for... Reasons of seeing Samus kick ass in an anime-esque version. Okay, holy crap, this is it, you guys. This is the last life of Thanos Bowser. We are definitely, definitely doing this. This is going to be the day that we beat Thanos Bowser. Ow, okay. That was not the anticipated result, but it's okay, because we still have a crap load of time left. Uh, okay, okay, yep, you can use the Reality Stone all you want, but it ain't gonna work, because now that I've gotten onto your strategy, um, I'm good to go. It's just like the, his strategy in Mario Odyssey. Ow, okay, right into the fire, apparently, but we're still getting it. This is not uh, gonna be another fail run. Woo! Okay, crap, that was too early, and I admit, that one was on me. Woo! Alright, how's it feel, Bowser, or should I say Thanos, Bowser? Your, your Infinity Stones aren't doing smack to you. I mean, sure, I mean, I'm surprised. I mean, you're probably just waiting till the end to snap your fingers, just like uh, a certain purple someone. Woo! Ah! Okay, crap, there goes my flame racket, but you know what? It's okay, we still have the other racket. Okay, I've got enough energy to combat that. And get it. And uh, get it. Yes. All right, and now we've got to save our shots for uh, Blazing Wall Shot, because I want to end this off on a super smash. Okay, I really need to get it together with this one. Up. Okay, come on! Come on. Ah, uh, come on. Oh, this is not good. This is anything but good. Get it? Woo! Okay, this is it. Thanos Bowser! I told you, you'd die for this! Woo! Oh my god, wait, we broke Lucian! Holy crap! I mean, there's only one way that could have generally ended, just breaking Lucian, but... Look at that, guys. We broke Lucian, and uh, the whole reign of terror on this island is without a doubt coming to an end. Okay, how can we get... Yeah, of course we got the teleporting powers, because we're the good guys, but yep, yeah, Bowser just gets buried in there. But of course he'll probably be back. You did it, Mario. You beat Bowser and Lucian, or aka Bowsian or Thanos Bowser. Now peace will return to this island, and the spirit of King Bass can finally rest in peace. Indeed he can. Thank you, Mario. Wow, for a game that's made me as angry as this one did, I'm surprised that to be actually getting like a little sad that the game's over now. Hmm, well that was indeed, that was indeed quite the adventure though. It all just led up to that one climactic boss fight. Whew! Alright, so now we're here. Bowser was able to obtain Lucian's power and, just as the legend foretold, he challenged you to a once-in-a-lifetime battle against his terrible might. But you were still able to prevail thanks to the strength you acquired in our adventure. You beat Bowser. The story of your victory will be told on this island for countless generations. You're a living legend. Uh, Mario's been a living legend since 85, so... Yeah, that's just another impressive feat of his. I know it wasn't easy, Mario, but you managed to save the day anyways. We were, we are so grateful for you. I still can't believe that rac a racket like that really existed. Only one that, that could actually control people. Well, I mean, this is the modern world, so pretty much anything could exist, Daisy. Ugh, do we really have to break it? What a waste. No kidding, we could have been the best players in the world with that thing. 
Yeah, and yet this happened. Haven't you learned anything? Didn't you see that Mario beat Lucian anyway, despite its terrible power? Yeah, exactly. Daisy has a point. No wonder you didn't make it into Smash, Ball, Luigi. In any case, I'm happy we got Luigi back. Yeah, Luigi. Hey, how you doing, buddy? Is your mind okay? The one, it's one thing to work hard and get stronger, but abusing such terrible power is never, the, is never the right answer. Yeah, for once, Peach actually has got a point. Strength only means anything if you use it to protect others, not to control them. So, hooray for Mario, our hero. Hooray, boy! Woo! And that's it, you guys. That's the end of Mario Tennis Aces. Wow, I gotta say, this was actually quite the adventure from the start, and... Yeah, in spite of all its similarities and the references to Infinity War I actually made, it was still a rather fun experience to kind of play this game, even though it really frustrated me, because using the power of zone shots, like, get those super powerful shots in, and then zone speed to just literally slow down time so you can actually hit those shots, and then all the other things that we actually did, that was without a doubt something worth, uh, this was without a doubt a game worth playing, in spite of all uh, the rage I went through with all that frustrating stuff because there were some episodes that really did frustrate me and it took me just uh, it again it's needless to say this game really frustrated me at some cases and you know it's a real shame we couldn't play as other characters but you know what it's a Mario game because yeah who else are you gonna play as is in a Mario game well I mean there was some games where you could play as characters other than Mario like Super Mario 3D World yeah that list can go on for quite some time but Nevertheless, okay, I gotta say, I like this music, and then the graphics of this game were also pretty good. I mean, I decided to play this game back in June because mainly I thought it was going to be a popular game, and it actually was pretty popular, and I'm really sorry, again, if I made you guys cringe with all those Infinity War jokes, but yeah, yeah, that was, it was still worth all the Infinity War jokes here. Okay, it's going to be one of those long end credit scenes where we're going through literally everything. So I got, <laughs> I really got to find, make, find ways to commentate on this. But you know what? This game was, uh, in spite of all the frustration and all the Infinity War jokes I made, I think I got to give this game a solid 7 points. Uh, uh, let's see, that's a hard one to determine here. I'm going to say, I'm going to give it a 7.8 out of 10 because it was definitely a little frustrating at some points, but mainly about because I was garbage at this and, uh, Mainly because my commentary was somewhat distracting me, but uh, in the end, uh, there was still very good physics, very good gameplay, a lot of really good stuff that I really actually enjoyed. Okay, seriously, there's like no way to actually skip this stuff, but uh, whatever, that's kind of my thoughts on Mario Tennis Aces here, and I might do a bonus episode or two of playing with the Genesis server, and just, you know, just doing a couple of matches with those guys. Commentary would be optional, but I, uh, of course, we can't confirm that at the moment, but... Anyways, again, as I mentioned earlier, I saw that Smash Direct with uh, Ryu, uh, no, Ken, Incineroar, and uh, Piranha Plant back on Thursday, and it was actually really cool. So I'm actually, without a doubt, pre-purchasing Super Smash Ultimate, probably while this video is uploading. So, yeah, I mean, of course, I actually have some really ambitious plans for celebrating the release of Super Smash Bros. Ultimate when it actually comes out, but I'll discuss that in a video that I will be posting November 7th. So November 7th, you guys, make sure you stay tuned for a super cool update video that will actually be discussing my general plans for the release of Super Smash Bros. Ultimate, because it is without a doubt going to be a real blast in more ways than one, because there's probably going to be a lot of explosions with, with bomb mobs and a whole lot of other stuff. Ah ha 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 ha. Puns for days. I know, I know. Puns, Infinity War references, a lot of that cringe is on this with this series and uh yeah actually if i if my knowledge is correct this might not might, this might not actually be the end of the series unfortunately because i think after beating adventure mode there's like a island of there's like an island of trials or whatever that kind of like bonus levels generally that you unlock when you beat uh that one uh general bonus mode bonus levels you unlock after beating story mode so you know what okay yeah, crap i didn't mean to take that picture but you know what unfortunately it doesn't look like my uh, escapades uh, with this game are over yet, but thankfully it doesn't look like we'll have to put up with the Infinity, Infinity Rocket and Thanos Bowser anymore. So you know what? That's still something to kind of look forward to. Ah, uh, yeah, the Super Smash uh, that I hit on Bowser at the end of all that adventuring. Wow. Again, this was quite the game to play to, but it doesn't look like it's over yet because of all the bonus souls. But then again, I don't think that update has come yet. But you know what? Just still stay tuned for that stuff. Nevertheless, you guys, so with that being said, oh, okay, wait, we got a cutscene here. 
Wait. Wow! Way to break the fourth wall, Mario. What better way to end off this series with a, with a good old fourth wall break? Like, seriously, Mario couldn't have ended off the series in any better way than with the fourth wall break. Just wow. Okay, um, okay, I'm just gonna check out what's going on here because I have the feeling there's something unlocked. Hmm. Yep, that's... Oh, okay. Yep, I knew it. There's the Isle of Trials right here, so it doesn't look like our escapades are over yet. So, yep, five levels. Uh, you know, as much as I can be, as much as I want to be frustrated with this not being the end of the series, I'm actually kind of happy this isn't the end of the series because of all the fun I just had. Mario, some ruins opened up here to the south of the stadium. We finally defeated Lucian, but now this pops up. Just our luck. Well, it's probably nothing to do with uh, Thanos' spells or in the end. The, Isle the ruins of Trials were added to adventure mode. All right, well, we'll keep that in mind for the next episode. So that, with that being said, that concludes story mode of Mario Tennis Aces. That's about all the time we've got today, so thank you all for joining me today. Be sure to subscribe, leave comments down below, because I like them, and crank that like button to the max like Soldier Boy. To land, I'm Hatfield15. Space out, bros and brositas.